I'm Jack, founder of Jack in the Box. Perhaps you remember when I was fired. Ever since that setback, I vowed to one day regain my rightful place as head of Jack in the Box. Today, thanks to the miracle of plastic surgery, I'm back and ready to make Jack in the Box better than ever. always asking me, what's it like to run Jack in the Box? I tell them, it's great. I have a corner office, terrific employees, a nice little jet, and products I believe in, like the Jumbo Jack. It's my classic Jumbo burger with fresh lettuce and tomato, and it's still just 99 cents. But you know what I like best about running a company? No matter how crazy my ideas are, I still get to do them. <laughs> Sometimes I'll go out in disguise so I can blend in and find out what people really want. Turns out they want a lot of great food for free. Dream on! But at Jack in the Box, you can get my Big Deal combo for just $1.99. It's a burger and fries and a drink, and I've added a taco, because I've heard your stomachs growl. Excuse me, do you make balloon animals? Sorry, I'm the head of a billion dollar company. Morning, Morning, Grandma. Morning, dear. Hi, Gramps. Hey, kiddo. So, Mom, what the heck's for breakfast? I'll have your sourdough breakfast sandwich with a fresh egg and ham and cheese. Oh, put me down for one of them ultimate breakfast, whatchamacallits. The, the big one with double everything. Oh, uh, Mom, the nearest Jack in the Box is 100 miles away. Did I ever tell you how difficult your birth was? Got your keys? <laughs> so, you like meat. Yeah. I like meat and I like cheese. Oh, too. Meat. Good. Watch the monitor. This is the ultimate cheeseburger from Jack in the Box. Yeah. It's a big cheeseburger for purists. Mm. Just meat and cheese. I like the meat and cheese part. Yeah. But why a bun? <laughs> Bun's not meat nor cheese. Word. Right. You lose that bun, you got something. Without the bun, your hands would be covered with meat and cheese! Yeah. All right, we'll look into that. <laughs> I'm no different than any other dad. I like peewee football and great big hamburgers. That's why I make the Jumbo Jack. It's a big, juicy jumbo patty, fresh lettuce, tomato, my classic condiments, and it's still just 99 cents. Hey, there's my kid. See him? Number 51. Pro Football's newest team is the Carnivores. Let's meet the owner, Jack. Why football? Well, Gear, I love the game. I'm a team builder, and I think the guys respect me. So, what's your first move? These are big guys, and they need a big breakfast. We're going to fill them up with my ultimate breakfast sandwich, maybe a supreme croissant. Let me tell you, that ultimate breakfast sandwich with the two eggs, the bacon, the ham, and the cheese, you're looking at a farm on a bun. Any other changes? Yeah. Perils of sloppy food. If only they'd ordered one of my portable finger foods, like my new cheesy macaroni bites. Lightly battered deep fried triangles filled with warm macaroni and craft cheese. Great for people on the go. Warp speed. On page 91, data for the new creamy caramel. Oh, it's a shake, for goodness sake. Oh, goodness sake. There. This message is for the heads of McDonald's and Burger King. Guys, I don't want to tell you how to run your business, but here's a tip. McDonald's, don't let your pre-assembled burgers sit in holding bins. And Burger King, those microwaves you use to reheat Whopper meat? Lose them. Now I know you're thinking, hey Jack, how can we thank you for this helpful advice? Forget it. I'm getting more joy from this than you know. In fact, I'm so excited, I'll be counting the days till you change your ways. OK, 
Okay. It's been seven days since I clued in McDonald's and Burger King about a great way to make burgers, and neither one's called me to say they're making changes. Maybe McDonald's doesn't mind pre-assembled burgers sitting around. Maybe Burger King thinks reheating Whopper meat in the microwave is okay. They probably just lost my phone number. Let's put it up. Okay, but remember, this is my private line, so don't call unless you're the head of McDonald's or Burger King. Thank you. I'm sick of waiting. I'm calling the owner of Burger King. Kathy, give me the number for the owner of Burger King. Uh, it's what? Uh, An overseas call? England? Uh, oh, that's right. Burger King is owned by an English company. That explains everything. We kicked their butt 200 years ago, and now they're using microwaves to reheat their Whopper meat to get even with us. It's so obvious. Burger King is owned by an English company. That's why it's called Burger King. Um, Jack, you're on, sir. I could have been an astronaut. I passed the tests, rode the rocket sled. I could be orbiting Earth right now, but I'm waiting for the heads of Burger King and McDonald's to call. Why? So I can help them make better burgers. Is my phone number up? Uh, here it comes, sir. Roger that. Yeah. How are girls different than boys? Uh, girls like clothes, they dance better than us, and they love unicorns. And boys... Boys like meat. That's why I serve up my totally authentic Philly cheesesteak, stuffed with sliced, marinated steaks smothered in melting cheese and grilled onions. And that is how girls and boys are different. What? Win Jack's stuff. Buy any medium or large combo and peel the sticker to win. Free music match downloads. 10 million food prizes. Nintendo DS systems. American Express branded gift cards. A year of travel on Southwest Airlines and vacation packages. Kawasaki jet skis, ATVs. Jack's Ninja 6R. Too bad he's not giving away his wife. I'd like to win a night with her. Jack employee's not eligible. For years, doctors have urged you to eat foods low in fat and high in fiber. Apparently, we got that all wrong. A new study shows that men and women should eat more stuffed jalapenos and baked cheddar potato wedges. Tests prove that when added to your meal, whole jalapenos stuffed with three kinds of cheese and bacon cheddar potato wedges can remove wrinkles. Furthermore, I believe bacon prevents hair loss. Where did you find this guy? Tobacco company. For the 99 boys, we represent Jack and his 99 cent menu. Heard that? Jack's my man. Serving up all sorts of tasty eight for 99 cent. Like his jumbo jack. It's got mad flavor and it's always served hot because he don't make it till you order it. Look at those fools. I ain't eating nothing that costs 49 cent. Word. Bling. You still there? Yeah, uh, can I get... Um... Dude, don't stress. Stick with the classics. Order my famous tacos. Crunchy, tasty, and totally affordable. Like the rest of my value menu. How many should I get? 30. <laughs> That's what I was thinking! Yeah, can I get 99 tacos for two cents? We can't do that. Um, I'm looking at the sign, and it says 99 tacos for two cents. Dude, it's two tacos for 99 cents. That's even less. Pick up two of Jack's classic tacos. They're totally tasty, and at 99 cents, totally affordable. You weren't really going to eat 99 tacos, were you? No. Yeah. Here, man, try this shake. It's thick. It's warm. Hey, that's a fake shake. Hi, I'm Jack. And this is my friend, Larry the Crime Donkey. Don't do fake shakes. Keep it real. Demand real ice cream shakes, like my frosty strawberry banana shake made with real fruit. Take it from Larry the Crime Donkey. Don't be a sucker. Say, Say no, no to fake, fake shakes. shakes. 
People say when I grow up, I should be like my dad. My dad's food makes people happy. Like his new sirloin steak and mushroom ciabatta with marinated sirloin steak, seasoned mushrooms, real provolone, and grilled onions on his famous ciabatta bread. But I don't want to make steak sandwiches. I want to be a vegetarian. Vegetarians are the best. What I like most about vegetarians is when my dog hurt his paw, we took him to the vegetarian and he got all better. This is fantastic. Kind of smoky and spicy. It's smoked jalapeno pepper. Chipotle. 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 Try Jack's new Chipotle chicken sandwich. Chipotle sauce and spicy pepper jack cheese give this grilled chicken breast sandwich its authentic Southwest flavor. Gracias. Hasta luego. Gracias, Lalo. Lalo. Just go. Take a good look at my new $1.99 Breakfast Jack combo. You get golden hash browns, the original Breakfast Jack, and a big orange juice. But why juice, and not coffee? For the answer, we volunteered Gary Kepler, one of our interns from Arizona State. First, coffee. Lots of pain. Now, juice. Feels nice. Thanks, Gary, and keep up the good work. Constitution and the cheesesteak. I secretly replaced the cheesesteaks of Tony's with my own. They're filled with juicy marinated steak and grilled onions and peppers smothered in melting cheese. Let's see if anyone noticed. How's that Philly cheesesteak? Wonderful. The best. Hey, you ain't Tony. I'm his brother, Jackie. Oh, yeah. Why do I serve breakfast all day? I do it for firefighters working round the clock, the ER doctors and nurses, the hardworking guys in the graveyard shift, the 24-hour emergency key guy. And of course, I do it for the college students who have never made it to a 9 a.m. class in their lives. You are the reason I serve a warm, delicious breakfast whenever you want. Hey, Jack. Hey. Want a donut? Why would I want a donut? Donuts are a scam. When you get to the middle, where the donut filet should be, you get a hole. I don't want a hole for breakfast. I want something warm and delicious, like my 99 cent breakfast, Jack. Or I could have my 99 cent French toast sticks. Those are tasty and filling. Enjoy your hole. Hey, Jack, want a bagel? Kevin, I want you to move to Philadelphia and learn everything about making an authentic Philly cheesesteak. I'll do my best, sir. Kevin. Yo, Jackie! How's it hanging, bro? I soaked up Philly like a sponge. My new Philly cheesesteak is the real deal. Marinated sliced steak smothered with grilled onions and melting cheese on a hearth-baked steak roll. It's really authentic. How you doing? Uh, maybe a little too authentic. You nailed that presentation, man. Thanks. Oh. Yeah. So, can you believe this, Mark? <laughs> Here's your snack. <laughs> Grown-ups need snacks, too. That's why I'm introducing Pita Snacks, a choice of fish, sirloin steak, crispy or grilled chicken topped with a smoky chipotle sauce served on warm pita bread. No, give it! Give it! You took it! How could you? What? The stain on your shirt. Honey, I, I swear, that's just lipstick from my secretary. Oh, oh, please. You've been dipping. No, I swear, I have been seeing Jessica. Oh, no, you're lying. It's dipping sauce. No! Admit it. You love Jack's new sampler trio. Stuffed jalapenos, mozzarella cheese sticks, new spicy chicken bites, and oh, so good dipping sauces. Who is this? <clears throat> um, this is Jessica. Ellen, what do women really want? Love. A shoulder to cry on. A soulmate. I meant on our menu. Oh, salad. Try my new Acapulco chicken salad. It's made fresh daily with savory chicken, pepper jack cheese, blue corn tortilla chips, and a tasty cilantro lime dressing. 
Jumbo Jack. Then you add two tacos. What do you get? Chumbaco, 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 Chum. Jack, I don't know why you keep pushing the Jumbaco. Research shows normal people like the Jumbo deal. Your classic Jumbo Jack made with 100% beef, two tacos, fries, and a drink for just $4.29. It's all their favorites in one meal. They killed my Jumbaco idea? I tried. So, Cousin Jim, how are you holding up? It's tough. I really miss shower curtains. How's the food? It's the worst. Found a tack of my meatloaf last night. So how were you? Good. Good. You know, busy. I'm bringing back my bonus jack, and you can get it as a combo with natural cut fries and a drink for just $3.99. Man, I'd kill for that. Yeah, you might want to keep that to yourself. Jack, you said you wanted a whole new breakfast item. I give you flapjacks. Hmm, yeah, um, the thing is, I don't know if I'm comfortable with people eating my face. How about a grilled breakfast sandwich with eggs, bacon, ham, and cheese on artisan bread with our new Kona Classic coffee to make the perfect breakfast? Don't do it. Don't eat my face. Do not eat my f- You ate his face? Aw, oh, Mom, you still clip coupons. Well, it all adds up. That's sweet, Mom. In honor of your thriftiness, I'll serve two croissant sandwiches for just three bucks, made with fresh egg, sausage, or our new hickory smoked bacon and melting cheese. You're such a good son. I'm so glad you dropped by. I love coming home, Mom. Patty, call the doctor. It's been more than four hours. Hi, Jack. I gotta go. That will be $22.50. $22.50? That's insane! Jack. What? It's not even a meal. I mean, right now at my place, you can pick three for three. People can pick three tasty items, including my new fries, and fill up for just three bucks. Oh, you're just a big softy. Nah, I'm still sad about the popcorn. And gooey pepper jack cheese. And that's how I met your mom. Like, uh, your, uh, ultimate. Say it. Steady. Cheese. Burger. Go! Ultimate cheeseburger. Hi. Yes, we are. We won't make it until you order it. Our best ultimate cheeseburger ever. Now a Jack in the Box. Welcome to Jack in the Box. Two ultimate cheeseburgers. Is that all? Uh. uh... Your ultimate cheeseburgers. Hot. Yes, we are. We won't make it till you order it. Our best ultimate cheeseburger ever. Now a Jack in the Box. Family man. Businessman. A can-do man with a plan. He's Jack, and he's not afraid to tackle the tough issues. Education. Environment. Milkshakes. I'm for them. That's why my classic shake combo has a big juicy jumbo jack, fries better than McDonald's, and a thick milkshake made with real ice cream. My opponent is a milkshake hating extremist, but not me. I have a golden retriever. Paid for by citizens who like classic shake combos. Mr. Box, hang on to your hat because sales of Jack's spicy chicken are about to take off. Imagine, every sandwich comes with chicken jack. Cock a doodle profit. Spicy Jack Flamenco Dancer. Spicy Jack the Pirate. Urgh. Look, people buy Jack's Spicy Chicken because it's a real chicken breast filet that has just the right amount of spice, and it's topped with fresh lettuce and tomato. Flaming Jack. Security. I, I couldn't stop 
We need to talk, Jack. What's up, Santa? It's your burger, the bacon ultimate cheeseburger. Huge, isn't it? Two quarter pound patties, three slices of cheese, and eight pieces of bacon. It's my biggest burger. I bought one. One burger for 40 elves, and they're so full we're already behind schedule. Oh, yeah. Your bacon ultimate cheeseburger could jeopardize Christmas. That burger was never meant for elves. Who's next? Hi, Stan. I'm Jack. Our kids are in uh, Little League. Well, I hope my humble hamburger meets with your approval. Of course, it's not as huge as your bacon ultimate cheeseburger, with its two jumbo patties smothered with three slices of melted cheese and eight pieces of crispy bacon. I'm just a hard-working mailman with store-bought buns. I'll just have some beans. Oh, sure. Mock my beans. Let's see, Todd. You've been with us here, Jack in the Box, for... One day. And do you know why you were terminated? I see Jack in the coffee room. I say, hey, Jack, you know that Jumbo Jack with the fresh lettuce and tomato you sell for 99 cents? He says, yeah. I say, what are you, stupid? Raise the price on that sucker. Mm-mm. See, Jack's pretty committed to that 99 cent price. It's in your handbook. Don't touch that. So... I'm in the elevator and Jack gets in. And I go, hey, and he goes, hey. So I go, Jack, you know your classic jumbo jack that's named after you with the fresh lettuce and tomato we sell for just 99 cents? And he goes, yeah. And I go, wake up. You should jack up the price and rake in the dough. And he goes, what's your name? And I go, Benjamin Choule. And he goes, you're fired, Benjamin. No. You tell Benj. Fired? What? Let go of I think he knows. <laughs> Do I hear 90,000? 90,000. 90, I grew up on your tacos. Thanks. You know, right now, you can get two tacos for just 99 cents. <clears throat> 90,000? I'd kill for some tacos right now. Jack's Tacos rock! Gordo! I used to work the drive through One night, I ate 15! <laughs> and we woke up with taco sauce on our foreheads! <laughs> so it's like 2 a.m. Me and Bert are completely out of our minds. Jack, I want you in my next movie. Picture this. You're an undercover karate cop who doesn't play by the rules. And you're teamed with a rookie. Or a babe. Or a chimp. What do you think? Picture this. A delicious chicken sandwich. It's spicy. It's crispy. I call it the spicy crispy chicken sandwich. What do you think? I love it. Well, that's too much. Girl. You know that there's one thing that I love But it's not you I'm thinking of I want the ultimate cheeseburger Break it down. Cheese meat, cheese, cheese meat and that's it Baby, you know it's hot and juicy This Jack won't make it till you want to rip Girls love this Our target is men What's a target? His spicy crispy sandwich ain't like the rest. It's got a natural spicy crispy chicken breast. I got the flavor you're looking for. I'm spicy, I'm crispy, you know you want me more. Spicy crispy chicken sandwich on a bun. We're all in the jazz room. Let's have some fun. You are so fired. Fired you. Excuse me, miss. Who are you? I'm an antenna ball. Can I interest you in a sourdough jack? You're not an antenna ball. You're a head case. Well, if I'm not an antenna ball, how would I know you can now get a warm, crunchy sourdough jack in a combo meal with a thick, frosty milkshake made with real ice cream? And if I'm not an antenna ball, why am I sitting on a car antenna? Not an antenna ball. Now who looks stupid? Excuse me, miss. 
Our bodies need good food. That's why every day we should have at least one what? Milkshake. Yes, a milkshake. Thick and frosty and cold and made with real ice cream. And where do we go for milkshakes made with real ice cream? McDonald's. Question? My mommy says ice cream milkshakes make you fat. Tell your mommy to be happy with who she is and stop being bitter about her thighs. Okay. My nose is a carrot. Hey. Um, I'd like to make a toast. Here's to the three newest members of the family. New Year's Ball, Snowman Ball, and Reindeer Ball. Get one free with the purchase of any large combo. I'm flying! <laughs> That's just wrong. Open the back. Millennium balls. You know, for antennas. They're free when you buy a sourdough jack combo. I gather the balls for a company retreat. It's a chance to get away from our offices and antennas and enjoy the great outdoors. It's a weekend for building teamwork and trust. The big news for this year is the Sourdough Jack, our most unique burger ever, is now even better because we won't make it till the customer orders it. Jack rescued me from a wild chipmunk. I love you, bro! One of my competitors says you can have it your way. Really? Good luck ordering breakfast after 11 a.m. Let's talk about my way. Yeah. My way means you can order anything on the menu any time of day, whether it's a burger for breakfast or French toast sticks at midnight. Other places won't let you do that. And hey, if I'm saying something that's not true, do something about it. We're launching a great new product served in a bowl. Who knows what it is? Peas. Coleslaw. Melon balls. Prunes. Mints. Little gifts. Poppy seed. Curds Bye. and whey. Buttons. Acorn. Shaved ice. You wouldn't think you could get an entire meal in a bowl, but you can. Introducing Jack's Teriyaki Bowls. Your choice of sirloin steak or grilled chicken on a bed of steamed rice topped with broccoli, carrots, and teriyaki sauce. Laser pointers. Lake trout. Lipstick. Starfish. Glitter. Rain. Marbles. Kelp. Confetti. I was in college once. I know what it's like to be on a budget. That's why right now, I'm offering the Jumbo Deal. It's a Jumbo Jack, two of my classic tacos, fries, and a drink for only $3.49. Man, that's a lot of food. It'll fill you up and let you save money for important things. Like school supplies. You know, it sounds good right now. A massage from your sister? What? What? Food. All right. Let's go to my place and grab some late-night munchie meals. For six bucks, we can get a bunch of stuff. Havesy fries, two tacos, a drink you can drink, and one of four awesome new entrees like the stacked grilled cheeseburger. Let's do it. Let's do it. Wee! But I can't fly. Not with that attitude. <laughs> What? All this for six bucks? That's my late night munchie meal. Comes with one of four awesome new entrees. I got an exploding cheesy chicken sandwich. I got a stacked grilled cheeseburger. I got two tacos, halvesies, and a drink. They all come with those. Mine came with the remote. Mine came with a picture of your family and your electric bill. You can keep that. Would you rather have spoons for hands or elbows for ears? I'd rather have food. <gasps> Let's make a late night foodie call and get my munchie meal with the new jalapeno burger. It's loaded with sliced and stuffed jalapenos, melting cheese, and spicy taco sauce. I'll eat it with my spoon hands. What? I can't hear you. Dug into my elbow. <laughs> 
He just said, it's big. How big? <laughs> really big. Tell him to send a pic. No. Okay. Whoa. Whoa. It's Jack's Big Stack. Two jumbo beef patties stacked with melting cheese, stacked with onion rings, stacked with pickles, all stacked on toasted sourdough bread. Oh, and tell her I'm easy. Because of the drive through Why is there a merman in the pool? Why is there a Kevin Federline ice sculpture? Why is there a grilled cheese riding piggyback on a cheeseburger? Why? Because things get weird late at night. That's why I make the Munchie Meal. It's a box full of crazy craveables like the stacked grilled cheeseburger or chicken tater melt, plus halfsy fries, two tacos, and a drink all for just six bucks. So get one tonight and get weird. Oh, hey, movie's about to start. Guess I should turn off my phone. You too. Oh, and when the movie's over, you should make a late night foodie call at my place. I've got this thing called the Munchie Meal. For six bucks, you get two tacos, half sea fries, and a drink, plus one of four awesome new entrees, like the stacked grilled cheeseburger. <sighs> I'll miss you. Don't worry, I'll turn you back on during the credits. At Jack in the Box, we believe in trying new things, like my grilled sandwiches, the delicious turkey bacon cheddar, and awesome deli trio, both made with premium deli meats and cheeses on grilled artisan bread. To new things! New, new things! things. <laughs> new things! There we are. Um, these days, we're all trying to save money. That's why I'm shooting this commercial myself, at home. It's really easy, and I can pass the savings on to you. Okay, ready for the food part? Check it out. My warm and flaky croissant sandwiches, supreme or sausage, both made with fresh egg and melting cheese. You get two for just three bucks. Okay, I'm back. Whoa! Ow! Oh, I'm so ready for this recession to be over. On his legendary quest, Jack ventured far and wide. Through the relentless dust, the fog, and the rain. Across state lines and county lines, he kept going. Until at last, Jack smelled something legendary. Garlic herb butter. Jack knew just what to do. Take the cowboy with him. <clears throat> and that's how the buttery Jack came to be. Our juiciest, butteriest, craviest burgers ever. The new Buttery Jack Burgers. From Jack in the Box. I dream about bacon. So I'm bringing back the BLT cheeseburger combo. A juicy jumbo beef patty loaded with hickory smoked bacon and melting cheese plus fries and a drink for just $4.99. But this isn't a dream. It's just a video for my last birthday party. That is a sweet toasted maple waffle stacked with cheese, stacked with a savory sausage patty, stacked with a freshly cracked egg, stacked with another freshly cracked egg, stacked with ham, stacked with more cheese, stacked with bacon, and topped with another maple waffle. It's called the Big Waffle Stack. How'd I come up with a sandwich that's got everything you'd want for breakfast on it? I don't know. It just came to me. Hey, you got groceries. Yeah, I thought we'd eat it at home. Save some money. 200 bucks? That's not saving. At my place, I'm bringing back the bonus jack. Two patties, melting cheese, and my secret sauce, plus fries and a drink for only $3.99. I get it. You can eat a lot cheaper at your place than you can at home. But do you have this? I have dessert. What about this? Oh. Oh. Jack, that's for Max. OMG, stop. 
Jack, your new Chipotle Chicken Club is crazy maze and Chipotle is totes trending. Spicy crispy chicken, hickory smoked bacon, melting cheese, and smoky Chipotle sauce plus fries and a drink for $4.99. That combo is Chipotle Cray. And Chipotle is my hashtag Fave Flav. Let me guess, you're the new social media intern. Yeah. Great, I'm late for a meeting. Can you make some copies? With a tanning bed? <laughs> OMG, Jack, have you ever checked out these new product ideas people post on your page? They're kind of a maze. Ping. Yeah, that's where I got the idea for my new jalapeno barbecue burger. It's loaded with crispy strips of onion and jalapeno, plus bacon and jalapeno barbecue sauce for just $3.99. Is that also where you got the idea for that clock bracelet you always wear? My watch? No. These were invented a long time ago. Like in the 80s? Am I going through menopause? You bet I am. But you'd never know it, thanks to the new tropical fruit smoothie at Jack in the Box. With my hot flashes blindsiding me, I need to cool off fast. That's why I love this delicious combination of mango, banana, and frozen yogurt. It keeps me cool, refreshed, and best of all, it helps me from going all, you know. Street rat crazy? Yeah. Jack, does your sourdough grilled chicken club appeal more to men or women? Well, lots of men really go for the grilled chicken breast, bacon, and melting cheese, while women really like the fresh lettuce and tomatoes on golden sourdough bread. Fascinating. Yeah, so we did some research to see who liked it more. And was it men or women? Hi. This sandwich is flawless. <laughs> I have no idea. All right, we need a name for our new chicken breast strips. Something that says these new chicken breast strips are real, like our old ones, but much bigger because they're sliced right from the breast. Hmm. Bigger breasts. Real breasts. <laughs> Big, plump breasts. Huge breasts. Um, big, uh... Don't go there, Phil. Okay, listen up. This is big. We have just launched the first 100% sirloin burger in fast food history. Take a look. That's 100% ground sirloin seasoned while it cooks. People can choose what kind of cheese and onions they want, but it's the sirloin that has to be tasted to be believed. Now, for those of you not from Texas, that's the sirloin area. Jack, our competitors serve Angus burgers. Could you point to the Angus area? I'd rather not. Do I win? That is not how you play the game. Play Jack's Big Rip Off. Order any large combo and rip the game piece for a chance to win one of five ultimate game rooms, free food, or cool stuff from Xbox, EA, and GameStop. Oh, come on. On his legendary quest, Jack went looking for a man known simply as the Onion Whisperer. The Onion said, you must prepare me three ways, then put it all on a burger and make a commercial about it. And that's the legend of the Cheddar Onion Buttery Jack. Crispy, grilled, and caramelized onion aioli. The Cheddar Onion Buttery Jack, part of the Buttery Jack family. Every morning, these men ate a tired breakfast and had a tired day. They weren't lumberjacks, they were slumberjacks. Then one day, Jack showed up with a breakfast burrito powered by jalapenos. It didn't just change their morning, it changed everything, turning these tree loggers into tree lovers. Spicy jalapenos, chipotle sauce with grilled bacon, eggs, and cheese. The jalapeno bacon breakfast burrito, only a Jack in the Box. It's summertime. That means grilling time. Some of us were just born to grill. And some of us weren't. Jack in the Box, where grilling is the real deal. <laughs> Cut!
<laughs> I have no idea what's going on. Maybe you're the original really big chicken combo with curly fries and a drink for just $3.99. Why the cowboy hat? What? You're the barbecue chicken combo with two chicken patties, bacon cheese, and barbecue sauce. You also come with curly fries and a drink for $3.99. I have no idea what's going on. Just go in there. This director's a genius. Today on Eating Cheap with Jack, room service leftovers. Timing is everything. Shrimp nubs have more meat than you think. Combine leftover drinks to make a hallway smoothie. And for dessert, pillow mints. When that doesn't work, head for my value menu. You'll find my new 99 cent junior bacon cheeseburger and my new 99 cent chili cheeseburger served just the way you like them. Cheap. Mom, I'm getting married. <gasps> Who's the girl? It's not a girl. It's bacon. If you love bacon, make it official. Bacon, you look beautiful. With my new BLT cheeseburger, a 100% beef patty loaded with hickory smoked bacon, plus fries and a drink for just $4.99. You may now eat the bride. Way out west, there's a story told about a bunch of cowboys, tiny and bold, riding tall, tall in the saddle, herding cows the size of schnauzers, but they're cattle. Yippee-yay, mini silver and burgers. Yippee-yay, mini silver and burgers. Yippee-yay. So you made some bad decisions last night. Make a good one this morning. Try my warm and flaky croissant sandwiches made with fresh egg and melting cheese. Choose Supreme or sausage. Right now, they're two for just three bucks. Come on, Cody, let's get some breakfast. You drive. I traded the car for the tattoo. Oh. You kids should save your money for a house instead of these fancy zesty turkey panitos. May your marriage be as long as this panito. Very nice. I see fresh oven roasted turkey, real provolone, sun-dried tomato sauce, and a lovely toasted ciabatta baguette. This is Trey's gourmet. Thanks for dating our wedding, Uncle Jack! Critter that makes burgers with bacon inside. Pork, it's beef and pork. Get bacon in your burger. Jack's new Bacon Insider has a juicy beef patty with bacon mixed right into it, plus bacon strips and bacon mayo on a new gourmet brioche bun. Pork, it's beef and pork. Get bacon in your burger. Moink? Wow, the really big chicken sandwich combo is back, and it's as big as ever. I'm gonna jump it. You can't jump that. It's two chicken patties topped with bacon and melting cheese, plus seasoned curly fries and a drink for only $3.99. What do you know? You're only a baby. Vroom! I'm T-Rex, and I came out of extinction. And that got a million hits? Yep. Why do we even make commercials anymore? Because you like to be in them? I can explain. The teriyaki bowls have been huge for us. Huge. And now there's the new Southwest Chicken Bowl, made fresh with fajita seasoned chicken, rice, and veggies, and topped with cilantro lime sauce. Everyone's crazy about bowls, so Jack said, let's all get bowl cuts. And everyone, and everyone did. Ed yeah. in finance. Liz from accounting. With the HR lady. That cute intern. Bowl cut day was a big success. Now we can all take our wigs off. <laughs> Sometimes
Sometimes I feel like we're different. Are we different, Dad? We are different, son. We only use real chicken breast fillets in our chicken breast pieces combo. They're not nuggets. And our fish and chips combo is made with whole fish fillets from Alaska. You bet we're different. And proud of it. But aren't we different in another way? Our fries are better than McDonald's. <sighs> That's my point. Guys, come on. We've been over this a million times. Pencil neck, pigtail. At least I don't need salt. Salt is for seconds. Hey, I'm not saying I like one fry better than another. It's just for a limited time. When guests buy a combo, they can upgrade to seasoned curly fries for free. Corkscrew, sucker. Don't make me get out my bag. Stop it. This free fry swap is for a limited time, so I expect you to behave like professional potatoes. Mr. Box needs a vacation. Alex. Jenny. Jenny. Carlos. Alex. Carlos. Good morning, burrito team. We set out to make a bigger, tastier breakfast burrito, and I think we nailed it. Introducing Bigger Better Breakfast Burritos. The Grande Sausage, packed with hash browns, sausage, and creamy sriracha sauce. And the Meat Lovers, stuffed with ham, bacon, and sausage, both wrapped in a warm Guerrero tortilla. Burritos so big, they make everything look smaller. <laughs> I'm making big changes to my burgers. The jumbo patties are juicier, the bacon's thicker. Heck, I had to get bigger wrappers just to hold them. Now it's time to see what real people think. Hi, I'm Jack. I'm Ronald McDonald. No way. Yep. All right. So what do you think? Delicious. Told you. Now my burgers are so good, even Ronald McDonald likes them. Today I'm introducing my best ultimate cheeseburger ever. The meat's juicier, there's new sauces, even the wrapper's bigger just to hold them. Now I want to see what real people think. Hi, I'm Jared. I'm Jack. Where are you from, Jared? Subway. Want to try my new ultimate cheeseburger? Sure. So? Really good. Proof. Jared from the Subway digs my best ultimate cheeseburger ever. I'm making big changes to my burgers. The jumbo patties are juicier, the bacon's thicker. Heck, I had to get bigger wrappers just to hold them. I can't wait to see what real people think. I'm Glenn Vopper. Chris Vopper. Glenn Jr. This is the home of the Voppers? Yes, it is. it is. Excellent. What do you think? It's great. That's the best. I'd buy this. Well, there you have it. At the home of the Voppers, my burgers rule. What happened last night? Apparently we went to Jack in the Box at 1.54 a.m. and got nine orders of tacos, four seasoned curly fries, and seven real ice cream shakes. So who drove us home? I did. Oh, why are you still here? He dared you to eat my keys. And why don't you call a cab? He dared you to eat my phone. <laughs> He was a giant of a man and a friend to none. When he rode into town, he blocked out the sun. Said, I'm hungry, Jack, need a change of pace. Make it big, make it good, wipe that smile off your face. I took a quarter pound patty, onion rings, melted cheese, big strips of bacon and that barbecue sauce, brought him to his knees. He cried, I gotta have one, Jack. I said, you better say please. Howdy, folks. Jack Box here with my new outlaw burger. Other places have barbecue burgers, but not with the kick this one has. Outlaw means it's loaded with hickory smoked bacon, onion rings, and topped with my bourbon barbecue sauce. And I'll tell you something else they don't have. My outlaw spicy chicken sandwich. Yeah. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Ride that spicy chicken. Stuck in a rut. No problem. I'd recommend my new buttermilk biscuits. Either sausage, egg, and cheese, or bacon, egg, and cheese. Huh? They're stuck in a rut. You tell them about your new breakfast? Yeah, I took care of it. Phil? 
I want to make sure the public knows they can get anything on our menu anytime. Mm -hmm. For instance, uh, breakfast all day, or maybe a burger. Oh! My boss just got hit by a bus, and it looks really, really bad. Hang in there, Jack. It's not that bad. No, it's really bad. I was just lying to him to cheer him up. All right, what do we got? Male, head trauma struck by a bus. It's a Jack the Box guy. Are you sure? Get in there. Yeah. Do I really like his uh, sirloin burger? Yeah, but the... Uh, Tacos? Breakfast? Breakfast. That's it. Nurse O'Brien and I often enjoy a midnight breakfast at Jack's. So anyway, Bob... Right, I'm going in. Give me a bone saw and a hot glue gun. Hey, Doc. How's he doing? He was hit by a bus. How do you think he's doing? He's in a coma. Is that good? He may not make it. Then I will take control of Jack in the Box and honor Jack's memory. He's, he's not, not dead. dead. Come on, he's close. I will yell from the mountaintops Jack's message. People can order anything on the menu anytime. Really? That does not ring a bell. Anybody home? How you doing, big guy? I was hit by a bus. Other than that, no complaints. I know you can't hear me, but I want you to know I'm moving Jack in the Box forward. Okay. I'm telling the world we serve anything on the menu anytime. Yay, Phil. And I'm changing the company name to Fill in the Box. Fill in the Box? I don't think so. Somebody find my pants. I got work to do. Oh, this is so relaxing. Thanks for inviting us. Anytime. Hey, are you two into trying new things? Are you talking about what I think you're talking about? I hope so. My new sirloin steak mill? Hot and hearty sirloin strips, grilled onions, and three kinds of melting cheese nestled between warm grilled sourdough? Yeah. Let's make a Jack sandwich. To me, bacon is the candy bar of meats. My parents' houseboat were on fire. First thing I'd say would be the bacon. Bacon makes everything taste better, especially bacon. That's why my bacon bacon cheeseburger is piled high with four pieces of mouth-watering bacon then loaded with bacon bits for a bacon party in every bite. Will somebody please make a bacon latte? Bacon is hot. During my bacon rescue, I'd walk out real slow so the strips get nice and crispy. You're about to see something that will revolutionize jack-in-the-box kitchens everywhere. An oven. To bake our oven bakes. The delicious chicken, spinach, and cheese, and the awesome Philly cheesesteak. Baked in a warm crust so they're gooey on the inside and crispy on the outside. Does it have a name? No, it's just oven. Let's name it! The Heat Machine. Oven by... Timmy Two Racks. Bandit. Vladimir Oven Max oven. Heat. Gary. Enough! It's the Heat Core 500! Whose nickname is Red Hot Todd. I like fun as much as anyone, but we need to talk about... Oh, what was that? ...about mustache safety. My blazing chicken sandwich has ghost pepper ranch sauce. You crave it, but you need to respect it. So remember, keep it neat before you eat the heat. Um, hi, Georgia. I just wanted to apologize again for what happened at the company picnic. Oh, that's hot. That is hot. Woo, daddy like. Oh, they're smoking hot. Oh. Mm. Oh. Hi, Georgia. Hey, Georgia. Man, this is hot. Try Jack's hottest sandwich yet. His new blazing chicken sandwich has spicy crispy chicken, ghost pepper ranch sauce, and sliced jalapenos. Ow, that's hot. You better be holding a sandwich. Check out my breakfast. I got eggs, sausage, ham, bacon, cheese, and toasted sourdough bread. Uh, mine's easier. Mmm. You know that guy? Get a load of Jack's Loaded Breakfast Sandwich. What's on it? What's not on it? Two freshly cracked eggs, ham, sausage, bacon, and cheese, all on toasty sourdough made just for you. It's like a big old breakfast buffet, right in your hand. So she says we're like two trees, and like my tree needs to grow more or something like that. What is that? It's my Jack hat. So they think I'm Jack. 
It works. I just ordered a combo meal, and when I asked for seasoned curly fries instead of regular fries, I got them. No extra charge, because I'm Jack. Because of the hat. Doofus, they're swapping curly fries for free for anyone. They don't think you're Jack. And how come they gave me his paycheck? Guess who I'm standing next to? <laughs> 22 bucks. These guys should have gone to my place, because right now, I have two breakfast croissants for just four bucks. They're both made with a freshly cracked egg and melting cheese on a buttery, flaky croissant. Try the Supreme with bacon and ham, or the sausage. They'll fill you up for Whoa, not much- hey! What? Stop! What are you doing? You can't make a commercial for your restaurant at my restaurant! Not if you keep interrupting me, I can't. Over the years, I've been the subject of many outrageous articles. First, the Bigfoot story. Then the alien thing. But now it's gone too far. I'm committed to great tasting food for 99 cents. Like my new big cheeseburger, a juicy patty with two types of melting cheese served hot because we won't make it till you order it. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got a corporation to run. So, uh, how'd that go? Uh, excuse me, these cash register buttons you sold me are worn out. Stress fracture. What are you using them for? My classic Jumbo Jack for 99 cents, well, plus my entire 99 cent menu. You know, burgers and chicken and breakfast biscuits. And... These are JR20s. They're not designed for a 99 cent menu with so many items. These are junk. You need the XL99, military grade titanium. Ooh. Jack, welcome to Signs and Stuff and Things. Yeah, I got this spicy chicken sandwich with just the right amount of spice, and it's served hot because we won't make it till you order it. But here's the big thing. It's real chicken breast. You got a sign like that? No. 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 No! Real chicken breast! How do you stay in business? How fast can I get a chipmunk tube top sign? Now that my, uh, Jack's spicy chicken is just $1.99. Come on, you ruffian. And remember, it's $1.99 for a limited time! Dad, what are you dreaming about? Work stuff. Hey, so I know gas prices are crazy. I don't know why. Stuff's just laying in the ground. It should be free. But it's not. You know what is free? My tacos. And they're premium, not regular. So here's what you do. Just bring a gas receipt to any Jack in the Box on Thursday, June 26th, and I'll give you two of my classic crunchy tacos for free. Don't forget to check your dipstick. <laughs> I said dipstick. How's the gas? I feel great. I love you, and I love you. And to show my love, guess what? On Tuesday, November 16th, I'm gonna give everybody everywhere free tacos. You sure you want to do that? Absolutely. You have good hair. Get two of Jack's delicious classic tacos absolutely free when you come into Jack in the Box Tuesday, November 16th. Ooh, that's a big tooth. Get two free tacos Tuesday, November 16th at Jack in the Box. Oh, boy. <sighs> this is a toughie. The thing is... There's double the chicken. I was just throwing me, too. Darn! I almost had something! Hey, what are you working on? We're trying to name this new chicken sandwich. But it's impossible because it's really big! Call it the really big chicken sandwich. Wow. Whoa, you gotta be kidding. You guys are exactly who I had in mind when I created my new jumbo breakfast platter. It's a ton of food. Eight of my new mini pancakes, hash brown sticks, scrambled eggs, plus bacon or sausage, all for only $2.99. It's just the kind of breakfast hardworking guys like you need. Yeah. They're here! Ladies, you have the right to remain sexy. <laughs> Who are you? I'm the breakfast fairy. What are you doing? Leaving you a few bucks. 
That's all you need for my sourdough breakfast melts. With your choice of ham, egg, and cheese, or bacon, egg, and cheese, both on toasted sourdough. Right now, they're two for just four bucks. There's no such thing as breakfast, oh, Barry! You're right. Uh, I'm Jack. I just put these wings on and broke in through your window to leave some money under your pillow. Oh, good. Because for a minute there, this wasn't making any sense. What's going on? What? You guys got sirloin Swiss and grilled onion burgers from Jack in the Box, and you didn't get me any? That's not true. Peppercorn mayo sauce on Jesse's shoe. Grilled onions, zesty pickle strips, and a bakery-style bun. Brandon's got that blissed-out look he only gets from 100% sirloin. And Jack's sitting right here eating one. So which part wasn't true? That we didn't get you any. But Jack ate it. Hmm? So in an effort to make bolder moves, I'm unleashing a bold-tasting chipotle chicken ciabatta sandwich. A spicy crispy chicken breast or a grilled chicken breast with a smoky chipotle sauce on lightly toasted ciabatta bread. Now who else is ready to be bold? I've never had the courage to say this. Come on, we're all friends. Your head is freakishly large. I don't want you to take this the wrong way. I just, gosh, it's hard. I just, I need more from you. No, 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 and no, it, shh, it, no, I totally get it. What if I gave you my new Chipotle Chicken Club combo? Spicy chicken with bacon, cheese, and chipotle sauce on toasted sourdough plus fries and a drink for only $4.99. That's such a relief. I don't want to be with anyone else. I want us to be together. Me too. Forever. You guys are just talking about food, right? Welcome to Jack in the Box. Can I take your order? Yeah. Is Jack there? <laughs> Just a moment. This is Jack. Mr. Box? Yeah, I'm, I'm really, really hungry. I was wondering what I should get. How much you got? About a buck. I go for my Jumbo Jack. A juicy Jumbo patty with fresh lettuce, tomato, onions, and pickles. Okay, thanks. You're welcome. Please pull up to the window. <laughs> Noise canceling headphones totally shuts out everything so I can concentrate on new products like my outlaw burger and spicy chicken sandwich topped with bourbon barbecue sauce, onion rings, and my new hickory smoked bacon. They're gonna be huge, real winners. And it. Hey guys, what's up? You're coming with us. It would help if you walked. What? No one ever said, that's the greatest thing since sliced lettuce. Ladies and gentlemen, bread is back, and ciabatta's in charge. Warm and toasty, soft and golden, it's the artisan bread that holds together my bacon and cheese ciabatta burger and the bruschetta chicken ciabatta, just two in my line of ciabatta sandwiches. Big, juicy, succulent sandwiches that call out, come and get me. Yeah, bread is back. I'm a flour-shaking, dough-making, bread-baking machine, and I feel the need to knead. Come on, admit it, you've missed bread too. So let's rise like yeast against the bread bashers. Let's lift our loaves and make a toast to toast. Because bread is back. Thirty-seven. Thirty-seven. Thirty-eight. Hello, thirty-seven. Thirty-nine. Forty. Forty-one. Forty-two. Forty-three. Forty-four. Forty-five. Forty-six. Daddy, why does the deli man hate you? Introducing two freshly made sandwiches from Jack. An ultimate club stacked with oven roasted turkey, hickory smoked ham, and mouthwatering bacon. And a roasted turkey sandwich with zesty herb mayo sauce, both on toasted hearth-baked rolls. Psst, dude, can you score me some coleslaw? That's 11,000. Could you take nine? Thousand? Dollars? 20 bucks for the hovercraft. Cash. And that's when it hit me. Everyone likes my stuff, but they want a bargain. So I created the big deal. It's a cheeseburger, fries, a taco, and 20 ounce drink for just $2.99. I'll give you 12 bucks for the pony. <laughs> he won the derby. Jack, 
gotta get up or I'm gonna miss breakfast. Don't worry, I serve breakfast all day. So you can get my new sourdough breakfast melts anytime. Choose from ham or bacon with egg and cheese on toasted sourdough. Get two for just three bucks. I'm bacon surfing. Hey, fifth grade teacher. Hi, Brian. This is an awesome dream. Woo! I've had better. So, Monsieur Jacques Box, you changed the name of your French fries to natural cut fries. Well, it's a totally different type of fry. My natural cut fries have the skin left on for a more natural potato flavor. And they're cut bigger and thicker, so they're golden on the outside and fluffy on the inside. You call them natural cut fries, no French. Yes, uh, we. Oui. So you have a problem with the French, no? No. No? We. Oui. We? Oui? No. No? We? Oui? Which is it, Monsieur Box? We oui, uh... oui, or no? Eh. I want the internet to work for me. I want the world at my fingertips. I just want you to try my new sourdough grilled chicken club. I am part dreamer and part... I wasn't done yet. My new sourdough grilled chicken club is a grilled chicken breast stacked with fresh lettuce, tomato, cheese, and mouth-watering bacon. Break the mold. Change is in the wind. Duh! I said it's a new kind of club. Can you hear me now? Can you hear me now? Can you hear me now? I was walking home, just picked us up two breakfast croissants for four bucks, when this bear attacked. With one swipe, it devoured one of the croissants. Then Jack showed up and took care of the beast so I could escape. And that's what happened to your breakfast croissant. And yours? It survived. Share it with yourself. Freshly cracked egg with ham and bacon or sausage. Get two breakfast croissants for four bucks. Keep going. Don't look at the thing. I looked at the thing. Only 260 calories? That's not even a sandwich. I should make a low-fat sandwich. Southwest chicken pita. Seasoned fajita chicken, roasted corn, black beans, grilled onions, and something zesty. Fire roasted salsa. Well, I bet he eats healthy. Why am I staring at a guy? You're hot. See? I like women. Did I say that out loud? Yeah, you did. I've called this meeting because I have big news. After several months, I've got it. A worthy successor to the sirloin burger. It's a barbecue bacon sirloin burger. 100% sirloin patty with fried onion rings, bacon, cheese, and barbecue sauce on a toasted bakery-style bun. The perfect addition to our line of sirloin burgers. Does that mean? Yes. We can all shave now. <laughs> yes. Yippee. You're just not getting it, are you? Look, you've got to trust me. It looks brilliant. I don't want to wear the hat. It's a cliché. It's a classic. This is a spot for your new barbecue bacon sirloin burger. People want to see the 100% sirloin patty, the fried onion rings, the bacon, the melting cheese, and barbecue sauce on the toasted bakery-style bun. And they want the hat. Oh, oh, so to prove that I'm using real sirloin, should I wear horns? Stand by with the horns. Jack's got nothing. I'm all in. Yikes. Hung fold. Coleman's got pocket tens. Are you bluffing? Does it look like I'm bluffing? Take it. Oh, I borrowed that. Don't worry, Gare. There's always my value menu. For just over a buck, you can fill up on any of my tasty value menu items. Jack's got bullets. Now that's a world-class poker face. Yes, I like the dusty rose on you, too. Oh, hello. Welcome back to Cat Chat. Today, we're having a spa day. So let's all be extra quiet. You thought I was bluffing? Try my new delicious taquitos with seasoned shredded beef and real cheddar cheese, or you're in for a cat chat-a-thon. Shh. Ivanka is in her happy place. Who's next for a mani-pedi? What I really love about being in Italy is getting away from the office, taking my mind off work. Jack! Jack! Dude, you open a restaurant here? I'm on vacation. Oh, bummer. Because mm. all they got here is Italian food. Mm. We're jonesing for something different. Yeah, I like that chicken fajita pita. All that tasty chicken, lettuce, tomato and cheese, and a soft warm pita. Yeah, that's a good one. So you got one on you? Mm. I have a job. 
Make way, America, for the special edition Jack in the Box Extended Value Menu 4x4. For about a now that Jack has beefed up his value menu, you'll be doing some heavy duty hauling. We're talking three big, meaty 99 cent burgers piled with tons of toppings. So climb aboard, America, and fill up with Jack. I am so sorry. Let's just think of warm things. My new steak grilled sandwich. Piping out with tender steak, grilled onions, and bourbon barbecue sauce. All covered with hot, melty cheese on grilled artisan bread. Hot? Steaky? Toasty? Melty? This isn't working. I'm just getting hungry. That's working. Oh! That's... Sorry. I said we should try a Chipotle chicken club. Spicy crispy chicken with bold Chipotle sauce on toasted sourdough, plus fries and a drink for $4.99. Did you say you want drinks? I said a drink comes with a combo. You know how to mambo? Of course I can do the robot. Leftovers. Maybe you think, yay me, I'm saving money. But let's face it. Leftovers is just another name for old food. But at my place, you can get a ton of new food for cheap. Try my 10-piece chicken nugget combo, 10 of my crispy all-white meat chicken nuggets, plus fries and a drink for only $3.99. Uh, 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 uh. You're welcome. To prove how authentic my new brew house bacon burger is, I'm going undercover at an actual brew house. That's awesome. Amazing. What if I told you you're eating a Jack's brew house bacon burger from Jack in the Box? Not this what? one. I'm too reliant. And what if I told you that I'm Jack? What? No! Oh. no. Didn't see that coming, did you? Order ale cheese sauce, grilled onions, and bacon on an artisan potato bun. Jack's brew house bacon burger. New from Jack in the Box. <laughs> hey, where'd Jack go? He was just here. Hey, where's my ball? Okay, first off, I want to welcome the new guys to Region 29. Plus, let's hear it for Chuck, who persuaded his hundredth customer to try a sourdough jack. We ordered that eye, Chucky. Steve-o? Okay, just a reminder from Jack, you may call these sourdough slices toasty, but not crunchy. The patty is juicy, cheese is melted, and the bacon count is four pieces. Any questions? Okay, let's be safe out there. Watch out for cats. I gotta say, I have no regrets. Two weeks ago, I decided to sell the loft, ditch the car, simplify. And even though I'm making do with less, I can still eat like a king. Because Jack's always putting new stuff on his value menu. Like his new nacho cheeseburger or chicken sandwich covered with nacho cheese and jalapenos for just a buck forty-nine each. So I can eat for practically nothing. Attention, trespasser! You have one last chance to get out of my treehouse! Uh, no. Hey, it's Jack! Hey! Yeah, you got anything new coming out? Well, do you like buffalo wings? Yeah. you like Frank's Red Hot Sauce? Yeah. Well, now you can dunk my chicken breast pieces in Frank's Red Hot Sauce, and they'll taste just like buffalo wings! Yeah. So now when you want the great taste of buffalo wings, you won't have to go to strip clubs! Morning, Jack. Can you sign these? What? It's 50th week. Why? Because for a limited time, we're serving diner milk combos. Classic 50s food, like a sourdough patty melt with grilled onions and melting cheese and a frosty chocolate malted crunch shake, served with your new natural cut fries. I am not dressing up. Oh, Jack, you're such a square. No, I'm not. The fountains of Rome are one of the things I love most about Italy. This is the famous Trevi Fountain. Legend has it that if you toss coins into Trevi Fountain, you will someday come back. You know, standing here, I can't help but think of my milkshakes. Because if you visit Jack in the Box and toss us some coins for a thick and frosty milkshake made with real ice cream, you'll definitely come back. Don't worry, that was about a buck. 
My high school years were pretty typical. I never really stood out. Did all the normal stuff, but nothing extraordinary. Well, that is until I started Jack in the Box and created the ultimate cheeseburger. It's outstanding. Two big quarter pound patties, three slices of cheese, everything you want, nothing you don't. It's the ultimate cheeseburger. You know, actually, I did get some recognition in school. For some reason, I was voted class clown. Go ahead, try it. Where's the nearest Jack in the Box? I found four places that sell socks. Not socks. Jack in the Box. A yak is a long-haired bovine. That's true. I like things that work. Like my no-nonsense all-American Jack combo. It has two 100% beef patties, melting cheese, lettuce, and tomato, plus fries and a drink for $4.99. Sounds delish. I found one D-list celebrity nearby. This is a landmark day for the automotive industry. The Aqua car is the first car to run on tap water. Zero emissions, 1,000 miles per gallon. I'm proud to announce for the first time in fast food history, a 100% sirloin steak and cheddar ciabatta sandwich. Tender marinated sirloin topped with real cheddar cheese on my famous ciabatta bread. Really? Sirloin? Man. I wouldn't do that if I were you. I'll pick you out of a lineup and send you to the slammer. You know what jail's like? Not a sourdough jack in sight. No golden toasty sourdough slices, no jumbo patties, no bacon, no cheese for you. That's hard time, baby! Any trouble here? No, officer. The young man's going to Jack in the Box. Can you give him a lift? I'm not allowed in the street. I'm like Jack's number one fan. He just gets me. Jack, it's me! Jack! It's lunchtime! I was really craving another hot sandwich on his famous toasted sourdough bread. Then he comes out with the ultimate club. Oven roasted turkey, black forest ham, bacon, which I love, cheese, lettuce, tomato, like he made it just for me. Doug, glad you like the ultimate club. Stop sending your hair sculptures. I have a stun gun. <laughs> Jack's the best. Room service? Good morning, sir. What is that? Ex Benedict? Oh, no, I ordered a sunrise panito. You know, tasty omelet, real cheddar cheese, black forest ham, and creamy hollandaise sauce all rolled up in a toasted ciabatta baguette. How you doing? I heard that new gourmet sunrise panito is only a jack in the box. And I didn't order those movies either. You see a lot of interesting things on the job, but I'll never forget the day we tried rescuing a man who was rescuing a kite. We tried everything. Then Jack came to the rescue with a Chipotle Chicken Club combo for $4.99. That combo was the real hero that day. A craveable combo to the rescue. Spicy all-white meat chicken with Chipotle sauce on toasted sourdough. The Chipotle Chicken Club combo. In the battle of the burgers, one man made a declaration of delicious, Jack. He set forth, armed with artillery no one saw coming, so that everyone could taste history-making burgers. And America ate it up. True story. We're so proud, we're giving away one million burgers, like the new Double Jack. Claim yours now. I'll have my usual ultimate cheeseburger. You can have that or two new versions of the ultimate cheeseburger. One has sliced jalapenos and creamy ranch sauce. The other has sweet and tangy barbecue sauce and grilled onions, plus double meat and cheese like the original. New versions? Two new versions. Now, this was just a training video, but these twists on my ultimate cheeseburger will blow people's minds. Is that guy okay? <laughs> When I come to this country, I think, who is the most successful businessman in America? Chapter 11, total restaurant makeover. Jack changes everything, even puts in flat screen TVs. So, uh, I do like Jack. Uh, yeah, $9,000 is a big investment, but you have to spend money to make money. Huh? Put eye on price. Totally tricked out restaurants. 
from the guy who wrote the book. Mr. Brad Haley? Relax! Did I win something? My sources tell me you've been calling Jack in the Box, Junk in the Box. So? I take these things personally, Brad. Get lost. Sure, just try my food, apologize, and I'll go. Beat it, clown! Listen, punk, my employees have been working their buns off to make the best burgers, shakes, and fries around. <laughs> oh, yeah! Whoop them good, Jack! Ah! Uh... Uh, Try a thick and frosty milkshake made with real ice cream. Yummy, isn't it? Very yummy. Thanks. Here, try a fry. Better than Max, right? Yeah. Be honest with me, Brad. What do you think of my burger? Tasty. Really? You're not just saying that because I could snap your arm like a twig? No, no, I shouldn't have just got food, man. I'm sorry, Jack. Well, I'm sorry about the grass stains. Really? No. To see you. He's upset about my spicy crispy chicken sandwich, isn't he? Yeah, he's pretty teed off. I thought he'd appreciate a really spicy, really crispy chicken sandwich. There's nothing else like it. He says go and never come back. Huh? And bleed the sandwich. Hope you enjoy it. Psych. Ana Chavez and Dave McElhedden. Chibata. C B A. Chibata, C A. Can you use it in a sentence? My original ciabatta burger is made with a juicy jumbo patty topped with green leaf lettuce, red onions, tomatoes, pickles, and a zesty sauce, all served on delicious, lightly toasted ciabatta bread. J. Ciabatta, C I A B A double T A ciabatta. Peace out. What are you doing to the jack-in-the-box clown? He's going bye-bye, lady. But he's so cute. Cute with the old jack-in-the-box restaurants. Now we stand for great new food, like our new hot ham and cheese supreme. Tender ham and tangy cheese on a toasted poppy seed roll. Mm. The food is better at the box. The food is better at the box. Waste them.